35-year-old Jim Birmingham moves a little slower these days than he used to. The chemical company's security director, husband, and father of a grown son suffered a stroke in February 2004, leaving him partially paralyzed on the left side. I turn out a light switch. One day it's, it's on, the next day it's gone. You have to say, my God, what's my life going to be like after this? For the last few months, three times a week, Birmingham has been helping to test the Locomat, a special treadmill that uses robotic arms to help him move his legs as he learns to walk again. Robotic components attach to his lower legs and hips, and some body weight is supported using a harness. Computer-controlled monitors synchronize the angle and movement of each joint, mimicking normal walking patterns. Okay, maintain those footsteps, that was great. Now that's me walking now, right? The machine is helping you. I am moving my legs. The machine assists them with their legs so they can feel the pattern um, that their legs are supposed to follow in normal walking, which they haven't felt since they've had that insult to, their, to the brain. And after a while, even without thinking about it, you start doing it right because your muscles remember. And Birmingham says he was happy to give robotics a try. I'm not opposed to technology, you know, so I just thought anything that's going to help me, I'll do it. This is Mary Morgan.